Hello everyone, this is magician Shankar Jr. from Gili Gili Magic, Urupi, Karnataka. Over the past few days, I have been receiving a lot of phone calls and messages from friends who have been asking me about uh, this rare phenomenon wherein uh, uh, there are people from Delhi or uh, Nasik or Uttarakhand and also from Udupi who have experienced metal objects being stuck to their body after they got vaccinated. So the news has been spreading around and in social media, it has been, the videos have gone very viral wherein you can, you see people uh, sticking coins and uh, spoons and forks onto their body. Their body got magnetized after they got vaccinated. Here I am with this video and I would like to talk about that and also demonstrate to you this phenomena. Uh, point number one, sticking metal objects to your body has got nothing to do with vaccination. Now, I have not been vaccinated because I'm still in the 18 to 45 uh, uh, age group and I'm yet to get vaccinated. So I, I will prove it to you that sticking objects onto your body has got nothing to do with vaccination. You can do it even if you're not vaccinated. So this works. Point number two, this phenomena will work with anybody. And the next part is it might not work with everybody. There are a few conditions which uh, need to be fulfilled. First of all, let's all see how exactly these metal objects stick to your body. I've shown you with the coin, let's say with a spoon or something like this is how you can stick metal objects to your body. As I told you before, I have not been vaccinated, but still I can show it to you that these metal objects do stick to my body and you know, it can, it can stay like that for quite some time and uh, try to stick onto my body and it does remain there for uh, stuck together as if it's magnetic. Basically, you don't have to apply anything to this. There is no gum or glue applied either to your body or to your uh, the object you're going to stick. It just stays like that. So this is how it works. You can keep it like this for quite some time and it will stay there. This mainly works on the principle of uh, surface tension. You know, your body, the skin has got a certain amount of surface tension onto it. And these objects uh, use, stick to your body because of that. If you keep an object on a cloth and you try to push it, it doesn't move forward so quickly. But if you keep the same object uh, on a tiled uh, floor and you try to push, it slides off. Now, our body works like that cloth wherein it doesn't allow the object to slide and slip down. So that's principle number one. Number two, that object or your body should have a very slight amount of moisture onto it. Now that moisture might come from your sweat or from the environment around you. So by, by default, these objects you're handling might have a little bit, it's, it's a very minute amount of moisture on it. That moisture combined with your the surface tension of your skin, these objects stick to it. Now, why did this become so viral at that instant? Thanks to social media, things go viral very soon. But if you would remember, a few years ago, there was this instance wherein uh, the idol of Lord Ganesha started drinking milk. If you would remember that incident. Uh, and that became so viral. Of course, that was the time when there was no social media at all. But still, it became viral. Why does that happen? Because of the timing of the incident. Now, if in general, if I would tell you that if you take a coin and stick it onto your forehead, it would stick, you would never believe me. Right? But then if I would say, see, I got vaccinated and uh, I tried this and this uh, gets stuck. Did you try that? And if you now pick a coin and stick onto your forehead, it will stick to your forehead. And at that point, you will say, wow, I do have supernatural powers. That is exactly how this phenomena works. Now, when someone saw a video of someone uh, sticking th things to their body and having all these uh, metal objects stuck to their body and claiming that has happened after vaccination. Suddenly people who just got vaccinated thought, why not I try if it works with me too? And then it, they tried on themselves and it did work. A few years ago, you might remember a, a similar incident had come up wherein a person claimed to stick objects onto his body, including an iron box. He stuck an iron box onto his body. That too works on the same principle. And another thing I told you before is that this will work with anybody. So if you would try to take metal objects and try to stick onto your body, it's very easy to stick on the forehead. It gets stuck very easily. You don't even have to press. You just need to have 
lightly keep it there and it gets stuck. Forehead is very easy on the other parts of the body. Now, again, I told you it might not work with everyone. That is because of the body structure. Everyone doesn't have the muscle mass or the angular, angle of the muscles or the body uh, surface in the same way. So if it works on the chest with someone, it might not work with someone else because the, uh, the indentations on your body might be different. So it might work for some, it might not work for some. So that, that is again a case and it is dependent on your body structure. But if you would try, it will definitely work somewhere or the other you stick and you try, it will definitely work for you. And you would understand that is not magnetism at all. Also, if your skin is too dry or if it's uh, hairy, you might not experience these metal objects sticking because the hair would not allow uh, the metal object to stick. Also, if you would try, if you think it gets stuck, I have another thing uh, to tell you. See, it, it gets stuck to my forehead, right? So that's so easy. If you want to challenge someone who claims that this is done with magnet, uh, magnetism, I think you should go with a talcum powder. If you take a little bit of tal talcum powder and if you rub it onto the area where you claim to stick objects, you just rub it like that and this will make the surface of the skin very, very smooth and also it will take, take out any amount of humidity. Because of that, if you try, these objects will not get stuck to your forehead because it's got that uh, talcum powder on. Of course, you, you do it more number of times, the tal talcum powder will wear off and then it will get stuck. But when the talcum powder is fresh there, it's on your forehead and you try to stick, it will never stick. It will fall down. So that is another way to test about magnetism because uh, if it was really magnet, uh, it would have stuck. Right. So now I would like to say this. All these videos that have gone viral, the intention might not be to fool people or to cheat people. The intention, I mean, of uh, the intention of posting those videos might be just pure innocence. They have tried it on themselves. It worked. They got shocked and they wanted to tell to people that I, I experienced this because of uh, vaccination. So that might be. And just because this uh, factor would work with anyone, it started getting viral. So soon people started getting worried. Uh, so take my words. This has got nothing to do with vaccination. Please analyze amongst yourself, uh, uh, consult an uh, expert on this and uh, don't get uh, cheated or misguided. So that's the only thing I wish to say. Thank you.